the sanctions against uh, Russia after Russia's totally uh, crazy aggression against uh, Ukraine, a sovereign free country of Europe, violating all Russia's international obligations, um, international law in a blatant way that um, none of us have thought we will see uh, in a modern Europe. So um, Denmark will go to, to uh, with our colleagues to discuss uh, both the sanctions that we agree upon, not only in Europe, but also with our partners in US, Canada, UK, Australia, um, uh, Japan, South Korea, and so on. It's very important that that the front is united against um, Putin and, and the way he's acting. This is fundamentally um, a clash between authoritarian, aggressive, militant regime that is uh, now have attacked a sovereign country and uh, the world that is believing in, in rules that has been there since the Second World War, norms, but also the democratic world where we will fight together in a democratic world to safeguard the dignity of people, protect uh, people and also uh, show full solidarity with our Ukrainian friends that are now suffering this horrible aggression. Is it on the table? You, will you discuss this issue today? For Denmark, there's no doubt uh, we are working for the most strong sanctions that we can uh, agree upon uh, and also, uh, also further steps that could um, isolate and punish uh, Putin and Russia for the acts that they have done. This is um, something which we want to react strongly about, not only in Europe, but but globally. So that's what we will do. We'll discuss the concrete sanction items with our colleagues uh, also today. Why is it so difficult to have SWIFT also on the sanctions? Mm -hmm. We, as I said, we will adopt the strongest uh, possible sanctions. Uh, the packets which we're going to adopt is uh, very strong packets, uh, hitting also the, uh, the bank sector in, in uh, Russia, uh, Russian oligarchs, uh, Russian economy, and so on, military people uh, with Putin and people around him. We are going to work for the strongest possible sanctions um, from the Danish side, and we will stand united with our European colleagues, with, um, with our colleagues across the Atlantic, US, uh, UK, and so on. The most important is to, to have the strong unity and front against this aggression that we have seen from Russia's side, and that is something we're going to confirm this afternoon. Thank you. Uh,